Greetings gentlemen and ladies, uh, welcome to today's video and I'm going to show you how I solved an issue where I had projectiles, especially fast moving small projectiles, uh, sometimes colliding with the object with the ground as they're supposed to, but sometimes passing right through. Uh, this is especially noticeable with fast moving small projectiles. Let me show you the issue first and then I'll show you how to fix it. Okay, so it happens pretty fast, but if you watch closely, you'll see uh, some of these uh, trigger a hit impact. You'll see the little dust explosion happen. Some of them pass right through the ground, so watch closely. Okay, so you could see actually a lot of them were passing through the ground that time. Uh, here's how to fix this issue. I think what happens here is that Unreal Engine sort of gets overloaded with the speed and the size and the detection of collision uh, when you have an, okay, so I have, here's my projectile right here. It's just a simple sphere object with a block all collision, blah, blah, blah. But here's how you fix this. Uh, go to, uh, on, your, on your object which collides, and like I say, in this case, it's, it's the sphere for me. I'll go to simulate physics and untick simulate physics. Now if you wanted to your, your bullets to bounce around and that sort of thing, this is not going to work. But typically if you're firing bullets, that's not really required unless you have a sort of special game. You just want your bullets to make impact. So watch what happens when I untick simulate physics. Um, basically Unreal Engine is now able to keep up with the uh, hit impact detection. Okay, so basically perfect. Uh, I, I didn't notice any bullets go through the ground. Uh, and I think that's basically, yeah, now that uh, everything's not being physics simulated, Unreal Engine is more able to process things. I think what happens when you have so many fast moving, moving small objects is it just overwhelms Unreal Engine's like physics simulation or something like that and it just can't keep up with uh, hit detection. And so you start getting weird stuff where some of the bullets hit and some pass through the ground. Uh, so yeah, that's it guys. Um, just change the, pr the, like I said, just change the, uh, the simulation, simulate physics on your object that makes the hit reaction, hit, uh, makes the hit, uh, take off physics basically. And also make sure that you're simulating hit, uh, hit events if you don't have that set. And if you're brand new to this, uh, you also want to make sure that your collision is something like block all or in this case mine's block all dynamic, but I could probably just change that to block all. Okay, hope you've enjoyed this video. Uh, and uh, I've just started up a Patreon. If anybody feels so supportive, I would certainly appreciate my very first Patreon. That would be pretty cool. Anyway, so see you guys in the next video. All right.